Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Michaela, and if you aren't, then welcome back, and thank you so much for coming back. So, in today's video, I'm going to be doing a Q&A, because I believe the last time I did one was December of last year, obviously. So, I thought we would do an updated one, and I have accumulated a good amount of questions from Instagram, so I thought we would go through these and answer these and got a few like simpler questions like how old am i things like that i'm 14 my birthday is november 8th because those were two questions that i um got a lot of people asking for some reason i have my jacket on right now because it is pretty cold in my room and i do have my fan on but the sound of the fan is like oddly comforting to me so we're gonna leave the fan the on. first question i have is tips on how to be more confident so i actually did do a video on this it isn't that good not gonna lie like the tips are there and they make sense, but I was just awkward, so maybe I'll redo that one day. Let me know if you guys would like that. But generally, I would say when you're doing things, realize what you're doing them for. Like, do them for yourself and not for someone else. Like, if you're going to wear something specific, know that you're wearing it for you and not for anyone else. Another thing I would say is feeling happy by yourself being able to be alone and have a good time by yourself before you're out there with other people those two things are like my top priority when it comes to being confident and where do you get all your jewelry from majority of the jewelry i actually make and then the rest of it is super random like i have these necklaces this is from the badass website which i always wear this one you guys know about it and then this one was gifted to me by my cousin which i love so much and then this is a necklace from tilly's and then all of these bracelets were gifted to me, so I don't really like purpose- Oh, I also made this, and this is from Tilly's, and these were also gifted to me. So I don't really like search for jewelry. If it comes to me, then I get it. I sometimes find cute jewelry at Target, but if, if you do want to get more into jewelry, I would recommend making it yourself because you can buy a lot of different beads for almost the price of like- five necklaces and then make a whole mess of different types of jewelry two video ideas i also have a video on this again pretty like cringy in my opinion i've done a lot of these videos like not a little bit ago when i was still not that confident on camera let's say if you're smaller if you want to grow on youtube i wouldn't recommend doing vlogs because nobody really knows you and as rude as it sounds they're not going to be that into you because they don't want to see your life if they don't know you although i enjoy doing vlogs so i record a lot of them anyways even though i'm not like bigger on youtube i enjoy vlogs so that's what i like to do but if you do like vlogs and you're still new on youtube i would do like routines because everyone likes routines and they're still vloggish um but you could totally do a, but there are so many different ideas i do have a video on it and there are some good ideas on there I'm just weird, but you can go watch that, I'll put it in the eye. Where do you buy your clothes? I actually got this specific question a lot. I mostly thrift shop a lot of my clothes. This shirt I thrifted, and this jacket is from H&M, and then also jeans I'm wearing are from H&M. I love H&M so much. It's, I only go for a round one. I never go out of my way just to go, so I do like thrift shopping a lot. I find some clothes at Target, but I don't really like to get from Target because that's where like everyone gets their clothes and they have a small selection so i don't want to like have the same clothes as everyone else favorite billy eilish merch piece so probably this necklace or my shoes or my perfume but for a shirt i would probably say this one i'll put a picture here it's like the urban outfitters one with the orange blushes on it i wear that one so much just because it's so comfortable in general like out of all her merch it has to be this necklace i wear it every single day and i have like a serious attachment to it favorite billy song i would say wish you were gay overheated everything i wanted those three are like my top overheated is so good i think it's one of my favorites from happier than ever of course happier than ever itself but i really really like overheated but overall i think it's gonna have to be wish you were gay i've been enjoying my strange addiction recently but wish you were gay has always been up there like no matter what it's always always been up there so probably wish you were gay biggest inspirations um i have a lot of different inspirations for different things like when it comes to clothing and stuff i would say emma chamberlain and billy eilish they both have such great styles and they carry themselves so well so i think that's more where my sense of style comes in not necessarily that i have their style but because the way they carry themselves with what they wear and they have confidence for it that's where my inspiration comes in 
but as a whole it has to be my parents i mean my parents are literally like my parents are like when i make a decision the first thing i think of is what they would do because i want to be a good person and they are good people so i would probably say my parents but other than that i have so many inspirations for different things for youtube i really like emma chamberlain and fernando ramirez they both have great channels um i have a lot of inspirations but like i said the top two have to be my parents go on youtube when i first started youtube i did it with my friend and our idea was to like be the like the best friends everyone knew and like the top people but really my goal now is just to make this like a job i wouldn't call it a job just like something i can rely on it would seem almost impossible because it's such an amazing thing like to be able to do something you love so much and it almost feels like you're i don't know i don't know how to explain this without like sounding weird what's your favorite book ever okay here's the thing if you ask someone what their favorite book is ever they're gonna say like something like super like beautiful or something but i'm literally gonna say after by anatom which is a romance book but that's all i read favorite actress slash actor mm, i really like adam sandler he's a really good actor i don't know i don't really watch a lot of tv i prefer to like read or listen to a podcast or music but when i do watch tv i really do like adam sandler i just think he's hilarious what is your favorite type of jewelry to make? I really enjoy making bracelets. I like to make ugly bracelets because they look good on me for some reason. I also enjoy making like dainty little summery necklaces because I have super tiny beads. So those are fun to make. Rings are probably my least favorite. My favorite color is this like, not really this green, more like a matcha-y sage green. I also like brown a lot. Um, yeah. Someone asked me about the Shatter Me series and they asked if they need to read the novellas in order. So yes, I would recommend reading them in order because I always read all books in order. Like if there's a series and it's published a certain way, like why not read it like that? Just like when you listen to a music album, you typically listen to the first song to the last when you first hear it. Like the artists probably put it that way for a reason. So I feel like, yeah, I mean, if you don't want to, then don't. When did you start YouTube? Um, I think I started it almost two years ago. I started it in July of 2020. I started it in July of 2020, I'm pretty sure. If you go to my channel and then you click like more, it just say like the date made. So then after we made the account, we posted like a few days later. I mean, we as in, like I said earlier, me and my friend used to share the account she honestly just wasn't that into it like i had to be like we need to make a video so then finally i just changed the channel to my name and like okay it's mine and she didn't really care so how old are you i'm 14. how's youtube i've been having so much fun with the videos the editing uh, not so much but recording i've been having a lot of fun with and then when i post them i get so much like love and sweet comments so i have realized that people actually like kind of enjoy my videos any exciting plans mm not really i mean after i try to make a countdown for everything because that just gives you like a reason in the morning to be like oh my god if i wake up then a few more days to list it was the Billie Eilish concert but after that it's been the last day of school um and then after that it'll be when my family from japan comes because they're coming which is so exciting i'm super close to them so when they come we're definitely gonna make videos together and i'm super excited for that and you guys better be excited for that too because i know i am what makes you happy is laughing with someone like genuinely laughing with someone that i care about realizing that you are appreciating something so little someone said can you do a tutorial on how to make your videos or like how you edit okay here's the thing i've been wanting to do this video but one i do not edit in one big chunk I typically edit like on the bus on the way to school or right before bed like with my last five minutes before bed if you do have any questions on like certain things that i do you could totally ask that and i'll reply but i don't i wouldn't know how to like be like okay so this is how i do this this is how i do this this is something you're gonna want to know this is something you're gonna want to know i don't necessarily know what people are looking for and i don't feel that i have the skills to be able to share that with other people do you have any pet peeves if so what are they i really hate 
when people chew with their mouths open or they chew loudly like the sound of chewing or like slurping is just thank you guys so much for listening and thank you so much for watching make sure you take care of yourself drink water all of that and bye